So my book, The Liberation of Marguerite Harrison, America's First Female Foreign Intelligence Agent, is about America's first female foreign intelligence agent. Uh, Marguerite Harrison was a fascinating woman, although we've almost forgotten her today. She was a Baltimore socialite, and she became a newspaper reporter working at the Baltimore Sun. And then from there, she decided that she wanted to do uh, foreign intelligence for the Military Intelligence Division right at the end of World War I. And she went overseas. Uh, she went first in Germany, and then later they sent her to Russia. And she was actually caught in Russia and forced to become a double agent. She worked as a double agent for several months until she was then put in prison in Lubyanka prison in Russia. And there she stayed for nine months until the Americans were able to rescue her. Probably the most fun I had was actually going into the Russian archives to actually see the prison records that, that the Russians had uh, compiled on her, to see the documents she had, little slips of paper, from theater tickets from the Bolshoi Theater, her writings, her, uh, her little dictionary that she kept. You know, all these things were in the prison files and it really made me feel connected to her. And I hope that people will enjoy reading this story. I, as much as I've had a great time writing it, I hope that people will enjoy reading it.